Marty Time at the Deli Moronis Ice Van and David Tanner House for George's 39th birthday, the last year of his fucking 30s. It's fucking online, Donkey Kong. All the voters might as well kiss goodbye. Fucking, we're all partying here, and I've got Iron Maiden and Porn for my birthday, which is more than a boy could ever ask for. And we're gonna be rocking out tonight in Fire Tux in Pomona, 540 East Brother Boulevard, And uh, dude, it's gonna be fucking rad! Check it out! Why is this wizard one of the funnest games ever? What you do is you get a whole bunch of canned beer. It must be cans, it doesn't work with bottles. You get canned beers. Every time you drink a beer, you tape it to your new beer, fucking drink all these beers, and you build your wizard staff, and at the end of the night, whoever's got the fucking hugest ass staff is the wisest wizard, and may decree wizardly type of wizardish. Examples of wizardish wise rules. Wizardish wise rules? Whatever. Well, I mean, it depends on how you start it out, but you can decree that, uh, fucking, that you're gay. I never heard and of that. And I have to be gay. And you're gay, at least for until you build your sapphire. Oh wow, that's pretty brutal. So you know, it could be gnarly. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. All I know is it's, it's at the point where like lifting it is hard now. It's cr it's like crunching the can in as I lift. In the style. Beer bong, my All right. Every other night of the week. That's pretty good. We'll have to see about that. I'm just saying. We're already winning. So whatever. Hey, this is my first time playing. No, no, good job, dude. You're doing fantastically. Well, first time. <laughs> that works then. That is your exact height. In beer. Yeah, it's five feet of beer. <laughs> Alright, when somebody challenges you and yours breaks, do you have to start over? Or do you just tape it back together? So I don't care how fucking smocked and like snake wobbled out your shit is after you battle. If you fucking smock somebody else's goddamn fucking wizard staff and it splits apart, then you are the goddamn wisest wizard, dude. And that's how it works. I think that's really where the whole wisest wizard uh, staff fight lies is that when some point the staff finally breaks, that means it was a shoddy construction job by said other wizard and thus means that he has lost the battle of the wisest wizard. You institute party games that and then you mastered so that you conquer and destroy I institute all. party games that kick tons of ass. It just happens to be that I am an owner of tons of kick-ass party games. He's gonna bark. He's gonna bark from there. Over there. Not. <laughs> Why not? As long as he keeps talking, that's all that matters. It's like a bounce. It's like a bounce. Hey, hey, you have to put those beer cans back. What? <laughs> I need some duct tape. <laughs> Give me your hand. The other hand. That's the hand you touch your mom. Hallelujah! Yeah! You are the wisest wizard. None shall pass. <laughs> Hello all, thank you, thank you. It's my pleasure to be here as the wisest wizard at George's birthday party. Because George is a badass, motherfucking badass. So I hereby declare that as the wisest wizard that uh, all shall... Where's the duct tape? Uh... <laughs> uh...
get fucked up as much as possible and or participate in the wizard wizest wizard wizest wizest wait wisest wizard contest and <laughs> thus try to uh whatever it's called compete with me as I am the wisest wizard and I shall smite those who do not believe it shall be true. So, thank you all, and I, uh... <laughs> oh my god, I'm fucked up. <laughs> Let's play some more. Go!